when you're looking at somebody to do your taxes, make sure they're legitimate. Read the reviews on them. And um, if it's too good of a deal to be true, don't take it. Um, TurboTax, as I've done some research, a lot of people have had this problem with them and a lot of unresolved. They've got a lot of people's money. And that should be, that's tax, federal tax money for the United States of America. They don't, they should not have any access to it at all, other than they already charge you $300 just to do a transfer. So they made their money on you. Why do they still have people's tax returns is the question I want to know. TurboTax did an e-filing for me, which they charged me $300. They did the e-filing to the IRS, so that way I would get the, the money back pretty fast. But it's been anything but fast. Uh, this filing took place, I believe it was June 9th, 29th, when uh, they were supposed to have filed it. So they, they claimed they filed it, but at the time, the bank that I was using, which was Cash App, um, didn't accept the deposit because it was too large. They only accepted 20000 and the return was 26000 So they sent it back to TurboTax. Now, TurboTax has a bank they use called the Tax Advocate Bank of Santa Barbara, which is five miles from where I live, but I don't have the address because they refused to give me the address. Um, they've had my money since July 4th or 5th. And they're refusing to give me the cash. I proved who I was. I've sent them uh, notarized copies of my identification. And uh, they claim that they sent me two checks, but I never got them. And so uh, then they said, oh, we had the wrong address. So I stay at the 7843, and they sent it to 7842. So, but when I sent them the notarized copy of my ID, it had the right address. I had made corrections with the IRS. And now um, the last contact that I had with the Bank of Santa Barbara was two weeks ago. And they said they were keeping my money and they refunded it when they were good and ready. Was, and I quote, that's what he told me. And then he hung up on me. And they will not give me any information. I ask for names. They don't give me any names, ID. And they're just straight strong arming me. And they, I feel like they're trying to purposely keep my $26,188, which, you know, during COVID, I pretty much lost a lot of things. And that money, I needed to get back on my feet. And I have a business plan and everything, but it's keeping me. They've taken away six months of my life because they're tying up my money. And I know they're making money with it. And this should be illegal because I have no business with that bank other than TurboTax did my e-filing. I've never banked with them. They don't, they don't even know who I am. They're just rude. I mean, the first time I called them, I was a whole seven hours before they finally answered. That's ridiculous. They got that much of your money. They should be answering your phone call quick. TurboTax was supposed to refund my three hundred dollars. I get to see a dime of that money, and then they told me I'd have it in two weeks. It's going on two months now, and um, they said it could take up to four months to refund something that they took out electronically from my IRS money on a service that they never delivered. So. Uh, they have that, and they have that 26000 not to mention what it's cost me not having my money and going into the hole because I was counting on this, you know, to help me out. And they're, I know they're making interest on it. And that's, you know, a large substantial amount for five, four or five months to hold your money and then tell you, we'll send it when we're good and ready to. I quote, that was exactly what I was told. I was lied to uh, about two months ago. They said they returned the money back to the IRS, which is protocol. After you know the, the return, your bank rejects it. The person that sent the e-filing turned that money, and they have not done so. But they keep telling me that they have, and then the bank manager let it leak out. We still have your money, which I knew they did because I run traces on it. And so I, I don't know what to do at this point because. They're straight up strong arming me. And I know I'm not the only person they're doing this to. I'm just the loudest. Because I need my money. <laughs> and it's a federal income tax. They have no right to it. It's my stimulus money that's in there. They have no right to it. We've been in a pandemic. That's supposed to help bring me relief. Some greedy bank is keeping my money. And they're not entitled to it. I don't even know these people.